Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well, and welcome to the new update on Bitcoin. As we have already seen that the price line of Bitcoin has broken out a very long-term channel and now it has formed another falling wedge pattern. And in today's video, we will analyze are we going to break it out or we are going to move more down from here. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more ideas, you can also support me here at the Patreon because here I am sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I shared. So let's start the analysis first of all. Let me to show you this daily time frame chart. And we have been watching this chart in my previous so many videos that the price line started the formation of this down channel here at the start of November and broke out the resistance here on 4th of Feb 2022. And after this breakout, uh, we had a short rally. Uh, we can see that after this breakout, uh, this rally was approximately 17% uh, or 17.5% and now we are having some correction. And now it is also moving above a very nice support of $42,000 as well. And previously this support has been breaking as a nice support here. And here it has been breaking as a resistance. And back here, if we take a look at the uh, January 2021, then here it broke as a very strong resistance. Therefore, right now it can again break as a very strong support. Now, uh, the major development that I want to show you on the daily time frame. Previously, we were watching that there was a hidden bearish divergence because the RSI uh, was forming another higher than previous high, but the price line was failed in doing so. But right now, you can see that the price line has also formed another higher than previous high. So there is not any hidden bullish di uh, bearish divergence on this chart anymore. Uh, therefore, we can expect that after some correction, the price line can have a reversal move to the upside. And we also have a, a nice support of the EMA 21 on the daily time frame chart as well. Previously, we have been watching whenever the price line is moving above the EMA 21, it has been using this exponential moving average 21 as a nice support. Therefore, this time it can again work as a support. Now switch to the hourly time frame. And here we have in another major development that the price line has formed this falling wedge pattern. Right now we are again at the resistance of this falling wedge. And as you know that it is considered to be a bullish reversal pattern. Therefore, it is possible that we may break out this pattern. We have the support of $42,000. We also have a support of the EMA 21 that is moving towards the upside. And uh, there is no hidden bearish divergence on the daily time frame chart now. And if we uh, again watch here, then obviously we are having this uh, falling value on the hourly time frame that is all, already a bullish reversal pattern. But it is possible uh, that it can break down the support, but I'm expecting that it can break out the resistance. Now, in case of breakout this resistance, our final target for this falling wedge pattern can be approximately here at $45,500. And we also have another short term resistance here, approximately at $43,000. And $800 as well. So next few hours are really very important. We are again at the resistance of this falling wedge and you can see that the movement is now very squeezed. So uh, very soon it can break out or break down. I'm expecting a breakout from here. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more ideas, you can also support me here at the Patreon because here I am sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I have shared. Take care. Goodbye.